Hello and welcome to South Dearborn High School 2020 Awards Program. My name is Jeff Bond and I'm honored to serve as the principal here at SDHS. Thank you for joining us in this celebration of achievements of these wonderful students. The awards program is one that we look forward to each year and this year is especially true. None of this would be possible if it were not for the tireless efforts of many, many people and the unbelievable support of our community. I would like to give a special thank you to the guidance department. Mrs. Moorhead, Mrs. Vendor, Mr. Gilb, and Mrs. Holt, they've done a fantastic job organizing the program. I would also like to thank all of our community partners for their support and commitment to SDHS, the students, and the administration. We'd also like to thank our central office administration, Superintendent Eric Glows, Assistant Superintendent Chris Tanner, and Director of Curriculum Dr. Janet Platt, as well as the South Dearborn Community School Corporation Board of Trustees for their support. Without further delay, let's begin with the recognition of our scholars and perfect attendants. To announce these award recipients, Mr. Josh Gilb. To begin our program, we would like to start by recognizing our academic awards. Uh, we have two categories here. Um, to begin with, we'll start with the high honor students. These students will receive a gold seal certificate and have earned a GPA of 3.65 or higher. Riley Amped, Tyler Baker, Lucas Bean, Cassidy Carter, Madeline Couch, Hannah Halbig, Megan Hickey, Lily Hoppus, Isaac House, Aaron Huber, Josie Hufford, Madison Hunter, Leah Kemper, Rachel Kittle, Allison Kunkel, Brianna LaGreca, Jalen Lowe's, Kara Manor, Elsa Meek, Wyatt Parks, Brooke Rowe, Kristen Rumsey, Morgan Schroeder, Shelby Sox, Caitlin Teeny, William Townsend, Jennifer Wollenweber, and Elizabeth Yelton. Those students earned a GPA of 3.65 or higher and are your high honor students. Next, we'd like to recognize the high uh, the honor students, those students had a GPA of 3.2 to 3.59 and will be awarded a Silver Seal Certificate. Stacy Arma, Cassie Ashcraft, Alyssa Baker, Jacob Black, Clarissa Conley, Maggie Couch, Caitlin Cutter, Timothy Dick, Casey Disbro, Sean Fisher, Carmela Hollen, Kanan Jackson, Savannah Lagman, Juliana Land, Jonathan Leone, Marcus Robb, Jace Somer, Regan Stevenson, Danielle Storm, Derek Tibbs, Jersey Tice, Jacob Walden, Kennedy Williams, and Brett Womble. Those students all earned a 3.2 to 3.59 GPA. All of those students uh, will also have a seal on their diplomas and will be recognized in the commencement booklet. Um, for having either an academic or technical honors diploma. Next in the program, we would like to honor our uh, perfect attendance. We had one student with four years perfect attendance, and that was Danny Palmer Jones. We also had students that were perfect attendance for their senior year only. These students are Riley Ant, Danny Palmer Jones, Wyatt Parks, Roger Seabury, Jacob Walden, and Alexis Wallace. 
All of those students had perfect attendance. At this point, I'd like to turn it over to Mrs. Lisa Moorhead. Next, we will honor the senior class members of the National Honor Society. Selection was based on scholarship, service, leadership, and character. A student must maintain an academic average of 3.60 or better. National Honor Society sashes will be worn during commencement. Joni Heffelmeyer is the sponsor. So we'd like to congratulate these excellent students. Riley Ant, Stacy Arma, Cassidy Carter, Madeline Couch, Hannah Halbig, Megan Heakey, Lily Hoppus, Leah Kemper, Rachel Kittle, Allison Kunkel, Brianna LaGreca, Jalen Lowe's, Elsa Meek, Brooke Rowe, Shelby Sox, William Townsend, Brett Womble, Jennifer Woolenweber, and Elizabeth Yelton. The statewide transfer general education core completers for 2020. The statewide transfer general education core, also known as the STGEC, is a block of 30 credit hours designed for students who plan to transfer their Ivy Tech credits to a public college or university in the state of Indiana. The STGEC is designated or is designed to prepare students for a successful transfer to a four-year college university of their choice and is a cost savings of over $20,000 to students and families. Upon completion of the STGEC, the student's official Ivy Tech transcript will reflect this achievement and students will receive a technical certificate from Ivy Tech. In total, South Durban High School students earning the STGEC collectively saved over $780,000 on their education. These students will receive an Ivy Tech honor cord symbolizing their accomplishment at commencement. These students are the following. Riley Ant, Stacy Arma, Cassie Ashcraft, Alyssa Baker, Tyler Baker, Lucas Bean, Cassidy Carter, Madeline Couch, Maggie Couch, Candace Curlin, Hannah Halbig, Megan Heakey, Carmela Holland, Lily Hoppus, Isaac House, Aaron Huber, Josie Hufford, Madison Hunter, Leah Kemper, Rachel Kittle, Allison Kunkel, Brianna LaGreca, Juliana Land, Jalen Lowe's, Kara Manor, Elsa Meek, Wyatt Parks, Marcus Robb, Brooke Rowe, Morgan Schroeder, Shelby Sox, Reagan Stevenson, Kinley Sweeney, Caitlin Teeny, William Townsend, Kennedy Williams, Brett Womble, Jennifer Woolenweber, and Elizabeth Yelton. We also have three students that earned a certificate from Ivy Tech in industrial mechanical technology. These students are Mitch Manford, Jace Somer, and Chris Stegemiller. And now Dr. Bond will be presenting our college and university awards. Our college and university awards are from the individual institution. Riley Amp, Anderson University, the Edwards Merit Scholarship, $34,000. Alyssa Baker, Xavier University, the Dean's Scholarship, $88,000 free books. Tyler Baker, Indiana University, Provost Scholarship, $8,000. Kirsten Bond, Columbus State University, out-of-state grant, $26,964. Athletic scholarship, $40,000. Cassidy Carter, Franklin College, Franklin Academic Scholarship, $80,000. Maggie Couch, Mount St. Joseph University, 
Mount St. Joseph Academic Scholarship, $48,000. Mount St. Joseph Grant, $28,560. Casey Disbro, University of Southern Indiana, David Rice Scholarship, $1,500. Adam Dixon, Wilmington College, Gateway Award, $10,000. Rec Recognition Scholarship, $20,000. Hannah Halbig, Thomas More University, the Presidential Scholarship, $72,000. Saints Award, Cleve Scholar Award, $6,000. Northern Kentucky University, the Commonwealth Excellence Scholarship, $44,000. Megan Hickey, Xavier University, Trustee Scholarship, $96,000, free books. University of Cincinnati, Cincinnatus Scholarship, $8,000. Lily Hoppus, Butler University. The Butler Academic Scholarship, $44,000. The Heritage Award, $48,000. Xavier University, Xavier Dean Scholarship, $88,000. Free textbooks. Indiana Wesleyan University Academic Award, $24,000. Josie Hufford, Hanover College, Hendricks Scholarship, $92,000. Crow Scholar Award, $16,000. The HC Campus Experience Award, $1,000. Madison Hunter, Hanover College, Hendricks Scholarship, $92,000. The Crow Scholar Award, $14,000. Brianna LaGreca, University of Cincinnati, Cincinnati Scholarship, $8,000. Access and Excess Incentive, $500. Jonathan Leon, Purdue University, Purdue Polytechnic Scholarship, $1,000. George Clark Scholarship, $1,000. Cornelius O'Brien Scholarship, $9,060. Kara Manor, Xavier University Presidential Scholarship, $94,500. University of Dayton, Academic Scholarship, $149,190. University of, uh, of Indianapolis, Academic Scholarship, $66,000. Brandon McGraw, Mount St. Joseph University, MSJ Scholarship, $4,500. MSJ Grant, $4,500. Early FAFSA filing, $500. Elsa Meek, Miami University, Merit Scholarship, Nathan Pruitt, Vincennes University, Athletic Scholarship, $4,700, room and board and books. Grace Quinlan, Indiana State University, Athletic Scholarship, $14,000. Purdue, uh, Fort Wayne, Athletic Scholarship, $24,000. Marcus Robb, Indiana Wesleyan University, Achievement Scholarship, $24,000. Brooke Rowe. IUPUI Chancellor Honors Scholarship, $32,000. Study Abroad Scholarship, $2,500. Murray State Provost Scholarship or Provost Stipend, $30,000.64. Chancellor Scholarship, IU Kokomo, $10,000. Ball State University Presidential Scholarship, $22,000. IU East Salutatorian Scholarship, $16,000. IU South Bend, Honors Scholarship. Titan Gold Scholarship, $500, $1,500. IU Bloomington, Provost Scholarship, $16,000. First Year IN Scholarship Award, $2,500. University of Utah, the FR Academic Achievement Scholarship, $3,200. IUPUC, Excellence Award, $4,000. IU Northwest Academic Scholarship, $2,000. IU Southeast Gold Recognition Scholarship, $3,500. Alex Shackelford, Mount St. Joseph University Academic Scholarship, $40,000. Shelby Sox, IUPUI Jaguar Excellence Award, $4,000. The Gabriel Storm, Saint, Mount St. Joe University, Caitlin Tini, Ball State University, Ball State Grant, $5,000. Ball State Scholars Award, $4,000. Indiana Franco Bannon Honors Incentive, $800. Franklin College Academic Scholarship, 
$20,000. Hanover College, Hanover College Grant, $7,335. Hendricks Scholarship, $23,000. From Purdue University, the Boiler Affordability Grant, $107. Access and Success Incentive, $500. Cornelius O'Brien Alumni Scholarship, $7,490. William Townsend, Ohio State University, the Provost Scholarship, $8,000. National Buckeye Scholar Award, $54,000. University of Dayton, President's Merit Scholarship, $84,000. Minority Engineering Scholarship, $10,000. Textbook Scholarship, $500, $500 per semester. From Rose Holman, Merit Scholarship, $95,000. University of Cincinnati, the CEAS Scholarship, $3,000. Cincinnati Century Scholar, $8,000. And from Jennifer Woolenweber, Indiana University East, Chancellor Scholarship, $16,000, and the Red Wolf Scholarship, $16,000. At this time, I'd like to invite Mr. Gill back to the stand. At this point in our program, we would like to move forward with all of our Dollars for Scholars scholarships. Um, to begin the night, um, we'd like to recognize uh, the, the South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars Challenge Scholarship. The South Dearborn Challenge Scholarship is awarded each November to SDHS graduates who are at least sophomores in college. It is funded each year by a grant from the City of Aurora and the Dearborn Community Foundation and at least 5,000 in funds from South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars. It requires at least 10 hours of community service, at least a 2.5 college GPA, and for the students to be full-time in college or trade school. In November 2019, South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars awarded 5,000 in scholarships to the following SD graduates. Dylan Beach, Olivia Bowers, Ashley Brown, Colt Hummel, Taylor Engel, Caitlin Mitchell, Courtney Teeny, and Sydney Yo. Next is the Brittany Kelly Black Memorial Scholarship. Brittany Kelly Black was a 2005 graduate of South Dearborn High School and a 2009 graduate of Indiana University. She was loved by all who met her and instantly made friends with everyone. She enjoyed reading, gardening, growing flowers, and working around the home. She had a keen sense of humor and a caring heart in the time of need. This scholarship was started by her family and is awarded to a student who will be attending Indiana University. In 2019, the scholarship became permanent endowment in the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 Brittany Kelly Black Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $2,000 is awarded to Leah Kemper. The next scholarship is the Katie Bruner Memorial Scholarship. Katie Bruner Memorial Scholarship is awarded annually to a South Dearborn High School student pursuing a post-secondary degree in either science, medicine, or the performing arts. Criteria included being active in student government and community service. Katie was a 2002 SD graduate and South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars recipient. She attended Anderson College in South Carolina majoring in biology and was a 2007 graduate of Northern Kentucky University. Katie's kindness, patience, and love for other people will be cherished by all she touched. The 2020 Katie Bruner Scholarship in the amount of $1,000 each goes to Alyssa Baker and Elizabeth Yelton. The David and Kay Chalk Education Scholarship. This scholarship is awarded each year to a senior who will be who will be pursuing an education degree in honor of David and Kay Chalk, former South Dearborn educators. This scholarship was, was established to encourage students going into teaching, particularly elementary early education. Kay Bruner Chalk grew up influenced by her mother, a Ball State University professor. Kay had a deep concern for education of young children. It was the family's hope that those awarded these scholarships would follow in her footsteps to help young children. In 2010, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 David and Kay Bruner Chalk Education Scholarship 
in the amount of $500 goes to Brianna LaGreca. Next is the Amy Cotton Memorial Scholarship. Amy Cotton was a 1991 graduate of South Dearborn High School. She passed away in 1994 following a hard-fought battle with non-Hoskins lymphoma. The Amy Cotton Memorial Scholarship has been established by the Cotton family through Dollars for Scholars as a tribute to the life of this amazing young woman. Amy's interest in school included music, citizenship, in our local community, friendship, family. The recipient of this scholarship has exhibited these characteristics as well as others. In 2016, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 Amy Cotton Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Derek Tibbs. Brandon Tyler Cromer Memorial Scholarship. Brandon Cromer was a memorial of the class of 20, South Dearborn class of 2017. He was a strong student focused on academics, athletics, and family. Brandon has a strong relationship with his grandparents and loved to help them any way he could. His family started this scholarship to honor his memory. The scholarship will be awarded to a graduating senior who has helped others during their high school career and left a positive impact on the life of others, just like Brandon did. In 2017, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 Brandon Crummer Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Derek Tibbs and Lily Hoppus. The Marvin and Sabra Durastock Scholarship. Marvin Durastock dedicated over 40 years of over 40 years to education. He was the first associate principal of South Dearborn High School for three years, then became the principal of SDHS for 17 years. The youngest of nine children and having lost both parents at a young age, he had to support himself throughout college. Because of his personal struggles, he, initi he initiated and was driving force behind South Dearborn's Dollars for Scholars program. Sabra Durstock enjoyed a career as a language arts teacher at Aurora Middle School and South Dearborn Middle School for 23 years. This scholarship was established to assist students who have overcome challenges in order to pursue post-secondary education. In 2017, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 Marvin Durst and Sabra Durstock scholarship recipients are Timothy Dick and Emma Hobbs. The Morgan Gentry Memorial Scholarship. Morgan Beth Gentry was a vibrant person. She was funny, brave, fierce, and certainly unique. She lost her father at a young age, but inherited an innate talent for woodworking and craftsmanship from him. She was taught by her mother to always be herself. Morgan always stood up for what she believed in and was a good advocate and proud member of the LB. T or LBTQ community. She was a 2012 SDHS graduate and then a 2016 graduate of Vincennes University, graduating with two degrees. Morgan sadly passed away in 2018 at the age of 23. At a point in her life where her future was bright and her world was teeming with options. This scholarship was established in memory to assist female SDHS graduates who will be pursuing a degree in engineering or construction. The 2020 Morgan Gentry Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $300 goes to Stacy Armagh. The Kathy Green Memorial Scholarship. Kathy Green Memorial Scholarship is awarded each year to a senior active in student government and community or school volunteer work. Kathy was an SD staff member who was one of the founding members of South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars. The leadership and work Kathy dedicated to Dollars for Scholars will continue for years and come due to her ability to lead others towards a common goal. In 2010, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 Kathy Green Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $600 goes to Elizabeth Yelton. The Deborah K. Myers Gus Memorial Scholarship. Debbie Myers Gus 
raised two South Auburn graduates before passing away in 1995. Debbie's family established this scholarship fund in her memory with the hope that the scholarship would defray the cost of textbooks required in continuing education endeavors. Because Debbie worked in the medical field, the scholarship is awarded to a student pursuing an education in the medical field. In 2010, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 Deborah K. Myers Gus Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Kara Manor. The Darla Jacobs Memorial Scholarship. Darla Jacobs Memorial Scholarship was established by the Dillsboro Elementary School PTO. Darla Jacobs passed away unexpectedly on May 14, 2018. Ms. Jacobs was a well-liked and loved teacher at Dillsboro Elementary School and worked, and worked in the South Dearborn School Corporation for 31 years. Darla was an outstanding educator who had a positive impact on countless students, regardless of their academic ability or social status. She was an inspiration to students and adults alike because of the enthusiasm she displayed in her everyday life. She loved helping children, finding the little nugget of potential in everyone, and watching them grow in ways they didn't know were possible. She always had a positive attitude, compassionate, and saw the good in everyone. This scholarship is awarded to two graduating seniors who attended Dillsboro Elementary School. The 2020 Darla Jacobs Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Tyler Baker and Caitlin Teeny. The Craig Jefferson Memorial Scholarship. Craig was a 2011 South Dearborn graduate and a 2015 Mount St. Joe College graduate. He worked as a financial broker for Amerifest. He played football at SDHS and Mount St. Joseph. He enjoyed all sports, especially football and basketball. Craig was a caring person and loved to spend time with his family and friends. He was a friend to many and will be greatly missed by all those who knew him. His family started this scholarship to honor his memory. The 2020 Craig Jefferson Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Brandon McGraw. The Corey Lewis Memorial Scholarship. Corey Lewis was a student in the South Dearborn class of 2015. During his first, during his first grade year, he started losing milestones and was diagnosed with a rare genetic disease called metacarac leukemia. An umbilical cord blood stem transplant was done in hopes to stop the progression of this disease. Unfortunately, he still lost all functions and was totally dependent for care. Over the next 15 years of his life, he was cared for by many types of healthcare professionals, doctors, nurses, physical, occupational, speech therapists, his parents, family, and friends. Most of all, his teachers, SDH staff, and fellow classmates were inclusive and enriched his quality of life. His parents started this endowment with the Dearborn Community Foundation in his memory, and each year a scholarship will be awarded to the SDHS senior who will be pursuing a degree in healthcare with preference given to those attending Indiana College. The 2020 Corey Lewis Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Elsa Meek. At this point, I'd like to turn it over to Mrs. Moorhead. The Vicki Lurson Memorial Scholarship. Vicki Lurson was a lifelong resident of the Dillsboro Aurora area. She was an educator for 29 years, with 28 years being served at Manchester Elementary School. She was an advocate for children and education. Vicki served her profession and community in numerous capacities. South Dearborn Educational Association president for many years, Indiana State Teachers Association district council member, Indiana State Teachers Association Board of Directors member and past member of numerous local and state education organizations, National Education Association delegate to the annual convention, Manchester Elementary Enrichment Play Director, Manchester Elementary Concessions Director, member of the Aurora First Baptist Church, treasurer of the Indiana State Teachers Association, Women's Caucus, and consistent generous donor to the Fund for Children and Public Education. Her scholarship pays tribute to her and 
all who were touched by her endless generosity and is awarded to a South Durban graduate who attended Manchester Elementary School. The 2020 Vicki Lurson Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Kara Manor. The Michael Marine Memorial Scholarship. It was established by the family of Michael Marine, a 2006 South Durban graduate. Criteria includes being active in community service, a passion for their future career, and a student that best represents Michael's character. In 2009, Michael's family established a permanent endowment at the Durban Community Foundation and continues to hold fundraising events in his memory each year. This year, the family generously decided to award three $1,000 scholarships. The 2020 Michael Marine Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $1,000 each goes to Riley Ant, Maggie Couch, and Allison Kunkel. The Cindy McGraw Mackenzie Stewart Memorial Athletic Scholarship. Over 30 years ago, in 1982, William Bill McGraw initiated the Cindy McGraw Scholarship after Cindy's passing in a car accident during her college years. Her father created the scholarship to recognize his daughter's passions and contributions to sportsmanship and academic achievement. Of note, a few past recipients of the Cindy McGraw Scholarship include Madison Stewart in 2004, Mackenzie Stewart in 2007, and Alyssa McGraw, Cindy's niece, in 2012. Tragically, Mackenzie Stewart passed away due to a car accident during her senior year of college. Her parents, Greg and Carolyn Stewart, initiated the Mackenzie Stewart Scholarship to recognize their daughter's passions and contributions to sportsmanship and academic achievement. Because of the remarkable similarities of both Cindy and Mackenzie as wonderful young athletic ladies of South Durban High School, the families and friends of these two young women agreed to create the Cindy McGraw Mackenzie Stewart Memorial Athletic Scholarship. This scholarship will be awarded to a female student who demonstrates leadership, sportsmanship, and a positive attitude in female athletics. The 2020 Cindy McGraw Mackenzie Stewart Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Jennifer Woolenweber. Matt McIntosh Memorial Scholarship was started by the family and friends of Matt Skinny McIntosh, a 2008 SD graduate and DFS recipient. Matt was a talented musician and this scholarship will be awarded to a graduating senior who is a four-year music band or choir student and has shown a true dedication to the South Dearborn High School Music Department. This scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation in 2014. The 2020 Matt McIntosh Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 each goes to Leah Kemper and Caitlin Teeny. The Mindy McIntosh Memorial Scholarship was started by the family and friends of Mindy McIntosh, a 2001 South Durban graduate and Ivy Tech student. Mindy worked full time and attended Ivy Tech part time and was pursuing an accounting degree. She took classes as she could afford them and her family established this scholarship in hopes of helping other students who need financial assistance in order to attend college. The two year renewable $500 scholarship will be awarded to a graduating senior who will be pursuing a degree at Ivy Tech Learnsburg. The scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Durban Community Foundation in 2014. The 2020 Mindy McIntosh Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Derek Tibbs. Carlita Meyer Memorial Scholarship. Carlita was a 1983 graduate of South Durban High School who was diagnosed with juvenile rheumatoid arthritis at the age of eight. Although her illness caused her to undergo numerous operations and overcome many obstacles in life, she always had a positive attitude, an infectious smile, and a true caring of others. This is awarded to a senior that represents those characteristics and shows determination to overcome anything that life sends their way. Carlita was dedicated to her family, church, and her community. These aspects may also be considered in the selection of recipients. The 2020 Carlita Meyer Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Elizabeth Yelton. The Chris Midland Memorial Scholarship is awarded to an outstanding member of the music department who is pursuing a post-secondary education. 
The student does not have to be a music major in college. Chris Midland was a talented musician and SDHS band member who was a member of the South Durban High School class of 1996. In 2011, his family established a permanent endowment with the Durban Community Foundation so that a scholarship can be awarded each year. The 2020 Chris Midland Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Emma Hobbs. The Donald Miller Memorial Scholarship Fund. The scholarship was established by the family of Donald Miller, a 1957 graduate of Taylor High School. Donald joined the Pipefitters Union in 1961 where he attended school two nights a week while working in his trade during the day. Donald made welding his career and was a member of the Plumbers, Pipefitters, and Mechanical Equipment Service Union, Local 392 in Cincinnati, for 45 years until his passing in 2006. Each year, at least one senior will be awarded this scholarship who plans to pursue a career in a trade such as welding, plumbing, etc. His family established this trade scholarship to honor his memory. In 2016, the scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Durham Community Foundation. The 2020 Donald Miller Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Jacob Black. Coach Jim O'Brien Memorial Soccer Scholarship. Jim O'Brien became active in the Dillsboro Say Soccer League in 1986. As his kids and the kids he coached in Say reached high school age, there was still a strong desire to play soccer. So Coach established the South Durban Soccer Club. In 1994, soccer became a school-sanctioned sport with Jim O'Brien as its head coach. He remained in this position until his retirement following the 2008 season. After his death in 2009, South Durban Dollars for Scholars and the South Durban Soccer Boosters established this scholarship uh, in his honor. Each year, at least one senior boy and one senior girl soccer player will be awarded a scholarship from this fund. The 2020 Coach Jim O'Brien Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $250 each goes to Josie Hufford and William Townsend. The Jan Powell Memorial Scholarship. Jan Powell was a 1980 graduate of South Durban High School. She attended the College of Mount St. Joseph and was the financial coordinator for corporate engineering at Procter & Gamble. Her parents established this permanent scholarship in 2006 with a gift of P&G stock from Jan's estate. The 2020 Jan Powell Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 each goes to Kara Manor, Brooke Rowe, and William Townsend. The Becky Ridland Memorial Scholarship. Becky loved her family, job, and friends. She was a medical assistant for Partners in Health and a lifetime member of First Southern Baptist Church of Sunman. But most important, she was a loving mother and was very active in all of her children's activities and was known as South Darren, at South Darren as the crazy show choir mom. Her family established this scholarship in her memory and it will be awarded each year to a graduating senior who participated in four years of band or choir at South Durban High School. The 2020 Becky Ridland Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Alyssa Baker. The Gary Russell Memorial Scholarship. Gary started his teaching career at Aurora Elementary where he later became principal. He was a funny, witty, good, and truthful person who was a beloved teacher, coach, and leader. His family, friends, and coworkers started this scholarship in his memory. The scholarship will be awarded each year to a South Durban High School graduate who attended Aurora Elementary. The 2020 Gary Russell Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Brooke Rowe. The Jim Thayer Memorial Scholarship. Jim Thayer was a teacher and coach at South Durban High School and was an inspiration to students and adults alike because of the vigor and enthusiasm he displayed in his everyday life and his perseverance and courage he displayed as he fought his battle with cancer. Jim was an outstanding educator who impacted the lives of countless students regardless of their academic ability or social status. This scholarship is awarded to a senior who plans to pursue a post-secondary education and who has displayed a positive mental attitude and demonstrated perseverance, compassion, courage, and a sincere dedication to South Durban High School. In 2019, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Durban Community Foundation. The 2020 Jim Thayer Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 goes to Alex Shackelford. 
the Tim Tyler Memorial Athletic Scholarship. Tim Tyler was a much loved teacher and coach with South Durban Community School Corporation for over 35 years. His passion was sports. He was a physical education teacher and health teacher, a tennis basketball coach, and youth basketball official. Tim had a positive impact on the many lives he touched, and his family started this scholarship to honor his memory. It is awarded to a graduating senior who participated in sports at South Durban High School at least two years, has at least a 3.0 GPA, and has shown a love for their community through volunteer work. In 2018, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Durban Community Foundation. The 2020 Tim Tyler Memorial Athletic Scholarship in the amount of $1,000 is Jalen Lowe's. And now Mr. Kurt Borntrager, Assistant Principal, will continue with the awards. The Gary Watts Memorial Scholarship. Gary Watts was a 1962 graduate of Aurora High School where he played football and basketball. In his spare time, he played tennis and golf. He served as a military police officer in the Army 25th Infantry in Vietnam and was an Aurora police officer for 16 years and chief for 12 years. He was the first Aurora police officer to graduate from the Indiana State Law Enforcement Academy. Throughout his career in retirement, he was known for taking kids under his wing to keep them out of trouble as well as volunteering his time with Just For Me, a nonprofit granting wishes to chronically ill children. His family started the Gary Watts Memorial Scholarship this year to keep his memory alive and will be awarded to a South Dearborn senior who has been active in multiple sports throughout their high school career and have volunteered their time to perform community service. The 2020 Gary Watts Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Brett Womble. The Aurora Fire Department Scholarship. This scholarship was established by the Aurora Fire Department. It will be awarded each year to one or two graduating seniors who are the child or the grandchild of a current or retired member of any of the local fire departments. The 2020 Aurora Fire Department scholarships in the amount of $750 each are awarded to Blake Sizemore and Caitlin Tini. The Barrett Family Scholarship. Two graduating seniors will each receive a $2,500 scholarship. Important criteria are community service performed in all four years of high school, dedication to the Dearborn County community, and the chosen field of post-secondary education. This scholarship was established by Jason Barrett in honor of his grandmother, Emma Jean Barrett, who was very active in the community service in the Aurora area. The 2020 Barrett Family Scholarship recipients in the amount of $2,500 each are Hannah Haubig and Riley Amt. The Barrett Family First Generation Scholarship. This scholarship was established this year by the Barrett Family of Aurora Casket. It is a permanent endowment at the Dearborn, County, the Dearborn Community Foundation and the scholarship will be funded by dividends each year. The scholarship is a four-year renewable scholarship worth $2,000 to $500 per year and will be awarded to a graduating South Dearborn senior who is the first generation in his or her family to attend college. The 2020 Barrett Family First Generation Scholarship in the amount of $200 is awarded to Megan Heakey. The Berninger Family Education Scholarship. The Ver Berninger Family started this scholarship to honor Joe and Jeff Berninger who were 2013 inductees into the South Dearborn Academic and Career Hall of Fame. Joe is a 1985 graduate and Jeff is a 1987 graduate and they are co-founders of Cooperative for Education, a nonprofit whose mission is to break the cycle of poverty in Guatemala. The 2020 Baron Berninger Family Education Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Madison Hunter. The Good Night Volunteer Award. South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars received a grant from Scholarship America to start a new scholarship in 2013. They had to make a written presentation on the importance of a renewable scholarship and how they would administer and fund a four-year renewable scholarship for South Dearborn students. They received a $10,000 grant this year and one well-deserving student will receive the seventh annual Good Night Volunteer Award Scholarship. This scholarship is a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation and a financial goal has been set so that the endowment eventually will fund the entire scholarship. 
the 2020 Good Night Dream Award in the amount of $500 goes to Allison Kunkel. The Ewan Family National Honor Society Scholar Honor Society Scholarship. One scholarship is awarded to a graduating senior who is pursuing a post-secondary education, has been active in student government, or has completed a cumulative total over four years of 60 hours of community school volunteer work, is a member of the National Honor Society, and is a member of one of South Dearborn High School's music groups during their senior year. This scholarship is sponsored by Naomi and Andrea Ewan with a matching donation from McDonald's of Aurora Lawrenceburg. The 2020 award winner is Lily Hoppus. The Foster Harris Football Scholarship. This scholarship was established by the South Dearborn coaching staff, the South Dearborn High School Football Boosters, and the South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars to honor longtime South Dearborn Athletic Director Foster Harris and to encourage South Dearborn football players to reach for post-secondary education goals. The 2020 Foster Harris Football Scholarship in the amount of $250 is awarded to Adam Dixon. The Ivy Tech Dollars for Scholars Matching Scholarships. Each year, South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars and Ivy Tech Lawrenceburg team up to award scholarships to divert deserving South Dearborn High School graduates who plan to attend Ivy Tech Lawrenceburg. Ivy Tech matches a South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars scholarship with another $200 scholarship. The 2020 Ivy Tech Dollars for Scholars matching scholarship in the amount of $200 from D South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars and $200 from Ivy Tech is awarded to Candace Curlin, Juliana Land, Serenity Lowe, Haley McDaniel, and Marcus Robb. The Bill Lakes Dillsboro Elementary School Scholarship. The Bill Lakes Dillsboro Elementary School Scholarship was established in 2011 by friends and coworkers and family of Dillsboro Elementary School Principal Bill Lakes upon his retirement. Two scholarships will be awarded annually to graduating seniors who attended Dillsboro Elementary. Grades, community service, and extracurricular activities will be considered in the selection process. In 2016, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 Bill Lakes Dillsboro Elementary School Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Brianna LaGreca. The Lawfrey Valley Veterinary Hospital Scholarship. Dr. Harley Robinson is one of the founding members of South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars and has been a board member since 1991. Harley generously donates his time to help on every committee and project and has been an elite sponsor in the Score for Scholars program for many years. Harley started this scholarship in 2018 to assist students in reaching their educational goals. The 2020 Lawfrey Valley Veterinary Hospital Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Rachel Kittle. The McDonald's Outstanding Employee Scholarship. Ed Cummings of McDonald's has been a supporter of South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars since 1991. The first 22 years as the main sponsor of the annual Run and Gun and the last eight years as a matching donor for our Score for Scholars program. The McDonald's Outstanding Employee Scholarship is for a South Dearborn senior who is employed at one of the local McDonald's and plans to pursue a college education. The 2020 McDonald's Outstanding Employee Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Lily Hoppus. The Moores Hill Alumni Scholarship. The Moores Hill Alumni Scholarship is funded by donations made at the annual Moores Hill Alumni event held each May at Carnegie Hall in Moores Hill. The scholarship is awarded to a graduating senior whose grandparents or parents graduated from the old Moores Hill High School. This scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation in 2014. The 2020 Moores Hill Alumni Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Alyssa Baker and Jalen Lowe's. The Project Lead the Way Scholarship. This scholarship is sponsored by Dearborn County ECO 15 coordinator Mark Neff and Stedman Machine to encourage participation in Project Lead the Way engineering courses offered at South Dearborn High School. The 2020 Project Lead the Way Scholarship in the amount of $250 is awarded to Brett Womble. Okay. 
the Rollins Family Scholarship. This scholarship is, is sponsored by Jared, Angie, and Bob Rollins. Angie and Jared are both South Dearborn graduates. Jared is a past South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars recipient, and Angie is a 2015 inductee into the two, into South Dearborn Academic and Career Hall of Fame. Their father, Bob, is a graduate of Moores Hill High School and a retired South Dearborn Community School Corporation board member. The scholarship is awarded to a graduating senior who has been in student government at least three years, been active in community service all four years of high school, and has at least a 2.5 GPA. The 2020 Rollins Family Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Elsa Meek. Patrick Savage. The Patrick Savage Academic Achievement Scholarship will be awarded to a graduating senior who plans to pursue a secondary education, vocal, vocational, tra trade, community college, or university. This student will also have shown academic achievement and overcome adversity during their high school years. This scholarship was started by longtime South Dearborn teacher Patrick Savage upon his retirement in 2013. To qualify, a student must receive a recommendation from one of the guidance counselors at South Dearborn High School. The 2020 Patrick Savage Academic Achievement Scholarship in the amount of $250 is awarded to Stacy Arma. The South Dearborn Baseball Scholarship. This scholarship was established by the South Dearborn coaching staff and South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars to encourage South Dearborn baseball players to reach for post-secondary education goals. The 2020 South Dearborn Baseball Scholarship in the amount of $250 is awarded to Adam Dixon. The Bill Slayback Memorial Basketball Scholarship. Bill Slayback was a graduate of Aurora High School, class of 1957. He went on to Indiana University with a full sport scholarship. He then decided to transfer to Franklin College where he graduated. He was inducted into the Franklin College Hall of Fame in 1998. Bill earned both a bachelor's and master's degree in education and went on to become a teacher, coach, athletic director, and assistant principal at Aurora High School and South Dearborn High School. In 2006, he was inducted into the Indiana Basketball Hall of Fame. Bill passed away in October 2019 and is missed by his family. Each year, a boy and girl varsity basketball player will be awarded a $500 scholarship in his honor. The 2020 Bill Slayback Memorial Basketball Scholarship recipients in the amount of $500 each are Kirsten Bond and Mitchell Manford. The Charlie Fayer Memorial Golden Glove Softball Scholarship. This scholarship was established by the South Dearborn High School Softball Boosters, former coach Tim Barrett and his wife Gina Barrett, the Community Spirit Credit Union, and friends of Charlie Thayer to honor Charlie for his dedication to the softball program and the South Dearborn Community School Corporation. In 2016, this scholarship became a permanent endowment at the Dearborn Community Foundation. The 2020 Charlie Thayer Memorial Golden Glove Softball Scholarship in the amount of $200, $250 is awarded to Morgan Schroeder. The South Dearborn Volleyball Scholarship. This scholarship was established this year by the South Dearborn Volleyball Coach, Denise Rose, the Volleyball Boosters, and South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars to encourage South Dearborn volleyball players to reach for post-secondary education goals. The 2020 South Dearborn Volleyball Scholarship in the amount of $200, $250, excuse me, is awarded to Grace Quinlan. The 2020 South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars Foundation Scholarships. Our foundation scholarship recipients, recipients are selected anonymously. Each of these students completed a 2020 South Dearborn Dollars for Scholars app application. Applicants are awarded points for community service, school activities, jobs, grades, test scores, and a recommendation from a teacher, coach, or supervisor. Funds for these scholarships are raised each year for, from our annual phone-a-thon Score for Scholars and matching donations from Ed Cummings and McDonald's of Aurora Lawrenceburg. Donations are also received from South Dearborn Community School Corporation employees through payroll deductions. <coughs> the 2020 Dollars for Scholars 
Foundation scholarships. In the amount of $250, Lily Hoppus, Grace Quinlan, Josie Hufford, and Blake Sizemore. In the amount of $500, Alyssa Baker, Aaron Huber, Rachel Kittle, Mariah Mobley, Kenley Sweeney, Jennifer Woolenweber, Tyler Baker, Madison Hunter, Elsa Meek, Shelby Sox, and Brett Womble. In the amount of $750, Brooke Rowe, William Townsend, and Morgan Schroeder. In the amount of $1,000, Hannah Haubig, Allison Kunkel, Leah Kemper, and Kara Manor. I welcome back to the podium now Dr. Jeff Bond. The Daniel E. Bellamer Award is awarded annually to a graduating senior who ranks high in scholarship, involvement, and character. This year's $435 recipient is Alyssa Baker. The Savista Charitable Foundation Award awarded to a senior entering college who has displayed outstanding qualities of leadership and scholarship, $1,500 to Riley Amp. The PFS Foundation Community Scholarship to honor a senior who has demonstrated outstanding service to the school and to the community and who is continuing post-secondary education in the amount of $1,000 is given to Alyssa Kunkel excuse me, Allison Kunkel and Caitlin Teeny. The Dearborn Savings Bank Scholarship for strong academic student that shows great leadership qualities and has demonstrated a commitment to school and community. And the amount of $1,000 goes to William Townsend. The Piercy L. Emma Conaway Memorial Scholarship Fund to assist seniors in pursuing their post-secondary education in the amount of $250 is Riley Amp, Megan Hickey, Allison Kunkel, Wyatt Parks, Caitlin Teeny, Lucas Bean, Leah Kemper, Brianna LaGreca, Brooke Rowe, and William Townsend. In the amount of $130, Tyler Baker, Hannah Halbig, Rachel Kittle, Elsa Meek, Jennifer Woolenweber, Madeline Couch, Josie Hufford, Kara Manor, Shelby Sox, and Elizabeth Yelton. The Lions Club Award to honor outstanding seniors who are pursuing post-secondary education in the amount of $1,000. Stacy Arma, Brett Womble, and Allison Kunkel. In the amount of $800, Alexandra Dabbs, Leah Kemper, Kate Lentini, Lily Hoppus, Shelby Sox, and Jennifer Woolenweber. The Willis and Jesse Hopmeyer Scholarship Award to recognize a student with outstanding academic achievement and to assist them in pursuing a post-secondary education in the amount of $575 goes to Wyatt Parks. The Class of 1979 Scholarship Award to honor an outstanding scholar of the senior class. The medal is sponsored by the Class of 1979 and a scholarship by Tri Kappa. The medal and $300 goes to William Townsend. The Tri Kappa Scholarship Award to provide financial assistance to an outstanding senior pursuing post-secondary education based on scholarship and leadership in the amount of $500 goes to Jalen Lowe's. The Chris Doerr Memorial Scholarship to honor a student who has demonstrated proper attitude and a willingness to pursue post-secondary education in the amount of $500 goes to Corey Johnson. The James Jason Jaina Miracle chemical, or excuse me, memorial scholarship to encourage a senior to pursue post-secondary education in the amount of $240 goes to Elizabeth Yelton. The Judge Lester Baker and Lynn Weber Memorial Scholarship the, uh, with the Aurora American Legion 
to be awarded to the South Dearborn graduate who displays outstanding potential in his or her field of pursuit, excellence in character, sincere desire and motivation to complete a post-secondary education, sponsored by the, American, uh, the Aurora American Legion and Auxiliary, in the amount of $500, goes to Alyssa Baker and Lily Hoppus. The sons of the American Legion, Dickie Dowers and Lynn Weber Memorial Auxiliary, Keith Ross Post 23, 231, excuse me, scholarship to award a student who displays good character, potential in their field of pursuit, and a sincere desire to complete the post-secondary education. The amount of $1,500 goes to Alyssa Kunkel, or excuse me, Allison Kunkel, Lily Hoppus, Leah Kemper, and Kara Manor. The Louise Lester Snyder Scholarship awarded to students from Clay or Caesar Townships who are continuing their education. $500 goes to Grace Quinlan and Caitlin Teeny. The Dillsboro Sons of the American Legion Award awarded to a senior from Dillsboro pursuing post-secondary education. $1,000 goes to Caitlin Teeny. The Dillsboro High School Alumni Association Award, awarded financed by the Dillsboro Alumni Association and awarded to a senior from the Dillsboro area in the amount of $1,000 goes to Brianna LaGreca. The May E. Pate Scholarship, awarded to a Dillsboro student pursuing post-secondary education at an Indiana school based on academic excellence and a commitment to community service in the amount of $500 goes to Caitlin Tini. The most outstanding Southeastern Career Center student from South Dearborn High School is to recognize the student who exhibits the most ability and enthusiasm toward their selected technical skill. Selected by the Southeastern Career Center and sponsored by Aurora Tri Kappa, in the amount of $150 each, the recipients are Fred Hauser and Megan Howe. The Carl J. Dutch Schmidt Mental Attitude Award is awarded to a senior who has shown an attitude of healthy competition, sportsmanship, school spirit, and excellence in athletics at South Dearborn High School. This $100 award goes to Jacob Walden. The Knight Scholar Award is awarded to senior athletes with the highest GPA. They will be receiving a plaque, and they are Brooke Rowe and William Townsend. The Manchester PTO Scholarship is awarded to a Manchester Elementary School graduate who displays outstanding potential in his or her field of pursuit, excellence in character, and a sincere desire and motivation to complete a post-secondary education. This $500 award goes to Aaron Huber. The Thomas Shawcross Scholarship is to honor a senior who is pursuing an education in the field of graphic arts or a related field. This $640 award goes to Cassie Ashcraft. The Walter and Anna Sibbett Scholarship is awarded to a senior who was promoted from Morris Hill School and has been accepted at a post-secondary school. This $1,000 award goes to Lily Hoppus. The Dearborn County Farm Bureau Scholarship is presented to a graduating senior who plans to pursue a post-secondary education and whose family has been at least a two-year member of Farm Bureau. This $1,000 award goes to Rachel Kittle. The Rising Sun Regional Foundation scholarships are awarded to seniors living in the city limits of Aurora pursuing a post-secondary education. The recipients will be receiving $1,000 each, and they are Stacy Arma, Rachel Kittle, Kara Manor, Jennifer Woolenweber, Isaac House, Savannah Lagerman, and Brooke Rowe. The Helen Wilson Petra Scholarship is to honor an outstanding senior who has excelled in the music program and who will continue to enrich others with their love of music. This $250 award goes to Casey Disbro. The CASA Essay Scholarship is to award a student who demonstrates good choices and who understands the importance of a healthy, drug-free life. This $500 award goes to Hannah Halbig. The Dearborn Community Foundation Scholarship 
is in the amount of $4,000, and this year goes to Megan Hickey. The Perpetual Rotary Scholarship is to provide financial assistance to an outstanding senior pursuing a post-secondary education. This $500 award goes to Allison Kunkel. The Denise Ann Byer Scholarship is to provide financial assistance to a deserving student who has the academic foundation, sincere desire, and motivation to complete a four-year program. This $500 award goes to Kara Manor. The Roger Gully Memorial Scholarship was established in memory of Roger Gully, who was killed in an auto accident in 1962. Roger was only a sophomore at Aurora High School at the time of his tragic death. This scholarship, in the amount of $350, goes to Leah Kemper. The Frank R. Longcamp Scholarship is awarded to a graduating senior pursuing post-secondary education. This $800 award goes to Allison Kunkel. The Lothry Valley FOP Scholarship is for a student pursuing a two or four year degree at any accredited college or university. Receiving $500 each are Hannah Halbig and Leah Kemper. The Michael Cleary Memorial. Michael was an East Central student that lost his life in an automobile accident. He had a good heart and liked to help others. This is awarded to a student pursuing a two year degree or certification. This $500 award goes to Jennifer Woolenweber. The Kathy Green Student Government Leadership Award is to honor a senior student who has demonstrated qualities of leadership, organizational abilities, and involvement in school activities. This $200 award goes to Elizabeth Yelton. The South Durban High School Student Government Awards are to honor senior members for their service to school and community. They each will, re will be receiving a plaque, and they are Riley Amp, Madeline Couch, Alyssa Baker, Kanan Jackson, Alyssa Kunkel, Allison Kunkel, Jalen Lowe's, Marcus Robb, Haley Rudisell, Shelby Sox, William Townsend, Jennifer Woolenweber, Carmela Holland, Leah Kemper, Brianna LaGreca, Elsa Meek, Brooke Rowe, Blake Sizemore, Kinley Sweeney, Brett Womble, and Elizabeth Yelton. And now Mr. Kurt Borntrager will continue with our awards. The Hartel F. and Laverne R. Denmuir Scholarship to be awarded to a South Dearborn High School graduate of good moral character who strives for excellence in the pursuit of a post-secondary education. $1,000 renewable for three-year scholarship is awarded to Jennifer Woolenweber. The Oxbow Scholarship for a student interested in preserving our natural resources and continuing their education in a related science field. The scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Rachel Kittle. The Friendship State Bank <clears throat> Wilk S. and James W. Lemon Scholarship is presented to a student who possesses a commitment to their community and who has maintained high academic standards. The scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Leah Kemper. The SEI Data Communication Scholarship is for customers with students who have a good GPA. Two scholarships in the amount of $500 are awarded each to Josie Hufford and Brianna LaGreca. The ASG Foundation Annual Scholarship is in recognition of possessing the most distinguished qualities necessary in preserving ASG's commitment in honoring community, pride, friendship, assistance, leadership, and courage. The $500 scholarship is awarded to Cashy Ashcraft. The Tom Cochran Scholarship, awarded to a student with excellent character and one who wants to pursue a career in law enforcement or a related area. This scholarship is awarded to Morgan Schroeder. The Indiana University Alumni Scholarship of Dearborn County is awarded to an outstanding student attending IU. This $500 scholarship is awarded to Jennifer Woolenweber. The Tim Pup Johnson Memorial Scholarship is awarded to a senior who is a hard worker with a good attitude and community involvement. The $500 scholarship is awarded to Alexander Dabbs. 
the JAG, Jobs for America's Graduate Scholarship. JAG is a career exploration and career development program. Our goal is for each student to graduate and to successfully transition into life after high school. In order to earn a certificate of mastery and $250 scholarship, the student had to demonstrate mastery of the 37 core competencies in JAG, complete a variety of assessments, complete at least 10 hours of community service, and attend a college visit and apply to a post-secondary educational program. The $250 scholarships are awarded to Casey Disbro, Savannah Legeman, Haley McDaniel, Madison Rourke, Haley Gibson, Alyssa Lloyd, Alyssa Pettigrew, and Erica Tony. The Ryan Livingston Memorial Nursing Scholarship is to recognize a student that is pursuing a nursing degree. This student must possess a sincere desire to help others through the nursing profession. The $1,000 award is granted to Alexandra Dabbs. The St. John's Lutheran School Scholarship for outstanding, outstanding citizenship and academics for a student that graduated eighth grade. $200 is awarded to Riley Ampt. The $50 scholarships are awarded to Rachel Kittle, Wyatt Pettit, and Allison Kunkel. The Ohio County 4-H Scholarship. The Ohio County 4-H Scholarship was established within the Ohio Community Foundation in 2002 by the Ohio County Extension Board. The purpose of the scholarship is to assist long-term participants of the Ohio County 4-H program with their pursuit of higher education. The scholarship is awarded to one Indiana current year graduating senior who participated the previous continuous six years in the Ohio County 4-H program. The $400 scholarship is awarded to Brandon McGraw. The Moores Hill Shell Day Night Scholarship, awarded to a senior that displays a strong work ethic and desire to be successful in their post-secondary studies. The $500 scholarship is awarded to Carmela Holland. The Anthony Munoz Straight A Scholarship is awarded to a senior who has excelled in their academics and athletics while overcoming, adver while overcoming adversity. $3,000 award is given to Timothy Dick. The Archways to Opportunity McDonald Scholarship, awarded for being a dedicated worker during high school. This $10,000 award is given to Cassidy Carter. The Anthony Munez Foundation Scholarship, awarded to a senior who demonstrates a desire and intent to overcome adversity, has financial need, excels academically, and fulfills a leadership role in the community. This award in the amount of $16,000 is given to Allison Kunkel. The Dearborn County 4-H Scholarship is awarded to a senior that has excelled and shown leadership in 4-H. The scholarship in the amount of four, $500 is awarded to Rachel Kittle. The Matola, Matola Family Core Value Scholarship for a girl soccer team member who displays outstanding team core values. The $500 scholarship is awarded to Caitlin Cutter. The Rising Sun American Legion Post 59 Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Brandon McGraw. And the Tri Kappa Charlene Powell Arts and Crafts Award to recognize a talented senior art student pursuing a post-secondary education in the amount of $300 is awarded to Lucas Bean. Dr. Bond will return to the podium. In our final recognition today, we'd like to formally announce our valedictorian and salutatorian. Our valedictorian for the class of 2020 is William Townsend, salutatorian, Brooke Rowe. We want to thank you for viewing our program, and we wish you well. Thank you. <laughs>